Lulu is tuning in again from London for Into Tech. Yes, there is more and more news on the rise of smart cities and Singapore is planning to be one of the first. But first, Lulu, what exactly is a smart city? Well, it's good to have a little bit of context because people always think of the Jetsons when you think of a smart city. But actually, it's just um, it's a good integrated urban management system. Uh, so um, and you use ICT to connect cities and to optimize systems so you can manage natural resources, for example, and people can be connected. So it's more an existing system that is yeah, improving the quality of life, really. Okay, I got it. It's not a newly built city, but what exactly is smart about these cities? Um, well, it's an increase in IT and visual inspection and monitoring. So um, everything will be connected to the internet and everything that happens in the city will be communicated. And um, so actually, you should think of a city as a large ecosystem, um, all connected to the internet. So you can really optimize living in a city. Okay, and what exactly can we expect from this first completely smart city? Um, well, it's, um, I think it will be really a smart city in 2020. Um, as Singapore is really good on the way to become a big smart city because they have like an urban laboratory, so you can, um, yeah, everything is planned, everything is structured. I've been there actually a couple of uh, years ago and it was really amazing. And do these cities have any disadvantages or do we all want to live in these new urban laboratories? Um, I think it's not for everyone because it's very futuristic. So, um, but if you like to live um, in a city that's really up to date and um, yeah, on top of the new developments, then it's definitely something for you. And I would love to live in Singapore, for example, because yeah, it's just a really good quality of life. Okay, thank you so much, Lulu, for giving us a small lecture about smart cities. And you guys at home, don't forget to like us on Facebook. Bye-bye.